Hi everyone, it's the eve of the first Grand Slam of the year, the Aussie Open. Don't forget to send in your predictions because you've got a chance of winning a tennis lesson and more importantly, a bottle of wine. Um, so for me, um, I would love to see Serena win it this year and get her number 24. Um, but I'm actually going to back um, Ash Barty, world number one, um, who just won the Yarra Valley WTA event and is in great form. Um, for the men's, I'm going to back Medvedev. Just watched him help Team Russia win the ATP Cup. And I think this is a year he's going to get a slam. So I'm going Barty and Medvedev. Um, send your predictions in. Um, it starts tomorrow. Two weeks of watching tennis, um, probably sleepless nights, um, but great to get tennis back on TV. Uh, so see you all soon and send those predictions in. Bye bye. Well, my predictions for the only one from this year would be uh, Daniel Medvedev, the men's, who that time we're going to slow, I think, at the end of the year, really on the hard court. And we're going to go for Victoria Hazarenka for the women's, two time Australian Open winner. Um, and I'm so going to take part of this year. Hi all. Right, so uh, favourite for the Australian Open tonight, I'm going to go men's Novak Djokovic and a home favourite of Ashley Barty. Hi, uh, my predictions for the Australian Open is uh, Djokovic for the men's and Barty for the win. So my picks for other Open this year are Ash Barty, um, number one seed, um, not, not been affected by quarantine for preparations, I think she looks good for, for the women's, and Medvedev for the men's, obviously won ATP finals end of last year, and is that a good uh, leading tournament this week, so they're my picks for Oz Open. Hey guys, so for the Australian Open, I'm going to say Ashley Barty for the women's and I'm going to go out on a limb and go Shapovalov for the men's.